Lego Harry Potter. Now that's what I'm talking about. I feel this is a return to the Lego franchise because what I liked about Lego Star Wars was the fantasy, the overnatural creatures, the force and all that good stuff. Lego Indiana Jones and Lego Batman were just normal platforming with generic humans you shouldn't care about. They were still good games though, but now it's back to the magic. With ghosts, brooms, wizards and magic wands, this truly is the best Lego game yet. The game tells the story of the first four Harry Potter movies. Wait, did I say movies? Well, the theme song is from the movie, so I guess it is. With your wand, you have a variety of spells like this big explosive thing, a light that scares away plants, and of course Vingardium Leviosa, where it can make things move in all crazy ways. It really brings back all the use the force concepts. And with some objects and people, you can even move them around at will. Freaking sweet. There is a lot to do. You can walk around in Hogwarts, unlock secret characters, and even make your own levels, which was actually introduced in LEGO Indiana Jones 2. But, for some reason, I never figured out how to resize the terrain editor. And the objects you get to build with here are just a lot more appropriate for making levels. So LEGO Harry Potter is another successful movie adaptation. 